Hello viewers, it's Leonard here again and in today's video tutorial I'm going to show you how uh, to drop ship, what drop shipping is all about and how you can start drop shipping with Ali Dropship using AliExpress. So AliExpress is basically a Chinese company that sells product at a wholesale price. Um, as the, you know, they sell this product at a discounted price and you as a dropshipper, you market this product to a particular country or to some few countries that you want to market to. And then how the dropshipping simply works is that you are setting up a website like uh, Jumia, like Conga, uh, a website like an Amazon. But in your own case, you are not going to sell uh, almost everything as it is listed. You know, going to Amazon, people find it difficult to, you know, search, search for the product they want to buy, for instance. People find it difficult buying a particular brand. Um, the same thing happened on AliExpress. It is not everybody that will get access to whatsoever, all the products that are listed on AliExpress. So when you cover the particular niche, for instance, let's say you want to deal with uh, women on the US, and then you set up a website like this, and you are selling all of these different kinds of underwears and clothing as the case may be people come to your website and they are focused that why they are coming to your website is just to buy underwears so um you set up a website like this this is a full working e-commerce website or woocommerce website as the case may be and this product um i have nothing to do with inventory of this product i'm not stocking any of this product all i just need to do is to run promotion to the website and once purchase is being made here, I send the person's details and his purchase and his order to the supplier of this particular product on AliExpress. And the person ship this product directly to that person in whichever country that my target audience are. So that is how basically hard drop shipping work. You stand as a middleman between the supplier from AliExpress and then the consumer who buys from you. So once the person places order, you send the person's uh, order, which I will show you in a moment, um, to the supplier, and then the product is shipped to the buyer straight. So the different what is uh, drop shipping is quite profitable because um, let's say for this particular product on AliExpress is listed as um, let's say five dollar, and then you are selling that for fourteen dollar ninety cent. Now, the difference between the $5 on AliExpress and this price listed here currently becomes your profit. So if I remove $5 from this, um, the basically what will be remaining is $9.90. So that becomes your pro profit after you might have removed your uh, expenses for promotion. So that becomes your profit. That is basically how drop shipping works. You can decide to sell electronics. You can decide to sell phones. You can decide to sell anything at all you can imagine all you just need to do and one thing about Ali dropship is that uh, it is a very helpful platform they have uh, an active uh, forum here where you can come here ask questions and you get answers and a whole lot of things that come with Ali dropship now the difference between this and uh, shopify is that it is cheaper and then it is a one-time purchase you don't need to pay monthly uh, fee or monthly subscription like Shopify, you have to pay monthly subscription and that is what everybody can't afford. Because if you cannot afford for the first two months to pay for this monthly subscription, that means you cannot become a dropshipper. So we, or just like the add-ons on uh, we have on Shopify, you have different kinds of add-ons there that will help you, you know, set up a complete website, a complete working website and uh, a WooCommerce website that you can start promoting. So a lead dropship equally comes with all of these different, some are free and some are paid. And the good thing is that it works perfectly with WordPress. So that is what I'm going to show you why you should use a lead dropship to set up your own dropshipping website and start making, um, selling products and marketing your product and then making a living out of it. So um, you can go to the reviews here, you see positive reviews, you know, there are over 50,000 people who are by customers who are using uh, lead dropship and the reviews are positive. I am equally using it and I can tell you that uh, since I started using a lead dropship, I don't regret using um, this product. So you can hear from those who are making some sex already. As you can see, this was published as of 10th of um, September. 2019 how a student entrepreneur experiment with dropshipping video games 
and all of these things you go here and read about other people's story how they are doing it and then you get an idea from what they are doing and you start it up with yours and equally i am here to help out if you want to set up a dropshipping website if you're in nigeria um, or wherever you are i can actually help even online if not physically in my office i can help um, set up set, set up a dropshipping website but it's, the processes are simply um, are very simple it's not something that is too difficult to do so basically the early drop shape works in two ways one is that if you want to set up this process you know you want to work step by step the way you want to set up your website by yourself you go ahead and do that and if you want it to be done for you you can order for a custom website so let me just open up this in a new tab um if you have money to invest in fixing a a dropshipping website where you want to market your product you can go ahead uh, the easiest way to start dropshipping business is by ordering for this custom website which um, Ali dropship equally uh, offers to you so all you just need to do is to see the different packages that they have here uh, the basic here is that with a 299 dollars you can get a custom working website and these are all the features that come with this so you have a niche, uh, a niche research um, premium domain name, a .com domain name, a unique professional design, you know, mobile device ready. All of these in our choice of products are unlimited. Numbers of products ready to sell 50. So these are all the features that comes with this. So for the $299 uh, package, it has its own benefits and its own the packages. And for the advanced, which is almost $500 and then the $900, all of these comes with different features so for this you have 50 product ready to sell for the 499 dollar you have 100 product to sell and then for the 899 dollar you have 200 product to sell and then when you scroll down you see the different features um, promo video is not available in this two but it is available in this so uh, early dropship will create a promo video for your marketing the way you can use to promote your your product and then social media promo to is equally available so if you like this um you can go ahead and order for this why you give them few days and a lead drop she will set up a complete working website um ready for business uh, for you but if you want to do it yourself which is what i'm going to show you in this video all you just need to do is to get the plugin and this plugin is a one-time purchase and it costs only 89 dollar and this with this now you get free updates and support you have all the automations you can ever need and then unlimited product to choose from so you can list unlimited product and it is a one-time payment so you don't have a monthly subscription and you have all the tools to manage and run a full world uh, a full e-commerce website so if you like this go on there there is a, v, a link on the description of this video where you can actually get a uh, dropship plugin and then hosting to start up your own fully uh, dropshipping website so before i show you the back end of my website i'll show you how this process simply work um basically there are things you need to set up a complete uh, dropshipping website so few things you need to start a complete dropshipping website are uh, these four things i've listed here the domain name you need a hosting and then the early dropship plugin and the wordpress team um so basically if you are going to use the hosting that i've recommended uh, which is tmd hosting that i'm using uh, the, the link is below the description of this video you are going to get the domain name for free and then it equally comes with a free SLS certificate so you don't need to pay and then that simply means this padlock that is always showing green at the top top of your browser here if your website your WooCommerce website is not showing secure um, it will be difficult for people to submit their payment information in buying from your website because Google will always uh, complain that your website is not secure so you are going to get that for free and then you are getting a domain name for free and for the hosting uh, that will cost you um, about ten dollar per month but you can get the lower packages which are there but I'm recommending what I am actually using for my hosting and the package which I'm going for so ten dollar per month which is not much and then for the lead dropship that is going to cost you uh, $89 and then the WordPress team is actually free except when you, you want to upgrade from the beginning but you can always start with a free uh, e-commerce e uh, or 
shop website and then you can always upgrade so um, basically to quickly show you about the hosting I use TMD hosting and I use the enterprise uh, cloud hosting so this goes for nine dollar um, 95 cent per month so you can go ahead and start with this this is because this is my own personal preference you can start with this particular one the, which is the most popular here, the business cloud uh, hosting and reason being that why I use TMD hosting is that um, you will need your website to be as fast as possible uh, you have unlimited bandwidth uh, unlimited SSDs and this help your website speed up unlimited website hosted that means with this particular hosting now it's not just my dropshipping website that I'm going to host I have other business website I have friends you know websites of clients that I'm working on hosted on this particular um, a domain name as well on this particular hosting package as well but with this you only have um, one website hosted with the first package yeah but with this second and the, the last one here yeah, you have unlimited website so you can choose from any of these depending on what you can afford so these are the different features that come on, uh, with uh, the uh, TMD hosting so I'll leave a link below the description of this video and you go ahead and check it out and see how you can set up your dropshipping website and as I said earlier if you, you are stuck in any way trying to fix up your website you can always contact me um, and through my blog or using the comment section below and I will definitely uh, give a helping hand out to help you I use cloud hosting but you can equally go with the WordPress hosting which is far cheaper and then you have for a one website uh, at two dollar 95 cent and then for unlimited website for the second one year you have four dollar 95 cent and then seven dollar 95 cent you can go ahead and choose any of these any of these you want to use because the future are pretty much um, the same and it will help your website run faster and then is best for you for uh, setting up an e-commerce website so go below the, the description of this video and then check out the, the link and see how you can get a hosting and then you need the plugin itself so to get the plugin all you just need to do is to buy now for the plugin click on buy now and then it will redirect you to where you make your payment so all you just need to do is to go ahead to get the payment and then if you need a hosting you go ahead and add the hosting but if you are getting hosting with TMD hosting you don't need any hosting yet so all you just need to do is to get um, the hosting and then you proceed to check out and you now start up setting up your website so basically um i'm not going to walk you through the process of setting up a wordpress website there is a, a video at the, in the description of this video that walks you step by step on how to set up a complete dropshipping website from the beginning to the end check out the link below uh, the description of this video and go through it and set up your own dropshipping website so now once you get this plugin uh, you set up your website let me just go to the back end of my underwears um, dropshipping website and show you how this simply works so the process is pretty much something a beginner can do you can do it from the comfort of your home without any um, issues so basically this is my dashboard and uh, as you can see I have a lot of product uh, on my website so once you install the plugin the early dropship uh, is the early dropship rule that I'm using because I'm using it with the WordPress website you just come here and click on it so let's say we want to import product into our website I'll just click on the import once I click on the plugin here I'll click on the import so once I click on the import uh, tab here I'll need to di import directly from a uh, dropship you can go to your import list and then you see whatever you imported to your list you can import directly from here these are the different product I can decide to search for any category here um, just go here and then click on any category you want and then search and put in your keywords here once you input in you can search with self category or you're just inputting the keywords here and the product comes up and if you are comfortable with it you just click on import but basically what i like doing is i first i go to the direct import to take me up to a lead dropship so once i'm here in a lead dropship and I'll need to type in the uh, whatever product I want to import. So let's say, for instance, I need to import um, some 
browse so i'll go ahead and type browse all right so this comes up now you can see because i'm logged into my website this tab is active so i can import it to the different categories that i have on my website here um, this is the website where i'm importing it to so i can choose one category here and i'm importing since i'm importing brow i'll just click on the category brow and then scroll down here so um this is the set browse set and then these are the different brows that aliexpress is giving us and uh, now this e packet that is showing up here is a method of shipping and i'm marketing my product in the us so this seems to be the fastest uh, way of shipping and it is it, it mostly free shipping so that is why i offer free shipping on my website so with this i don't need to pay even if the shipping i have to pay i don't pay much i can always get that um added into the, the price so let's say i want to import this into my website so i just need to click on it so that will open in a different tab um, i'll show you why i like importing product directly from aliexpress so this is it this even has a video attached to it so i can download the video and use it to for, for marketing and these are the different products here okay this cost uh, 77 cent for shipping to the us so i don't have a problem with that all i'm was i'm satisfied with this all i need to do now is instead of importing it directly i've selected the category where i want to import it to and then i'll just click on edit so once i click on edit um, this dialog box comes up here i can actually set up things for seo purposes because i will not just be based on marketing alone um, I will equally concentrate on SEO. This title is too long, so I'll make it shorter and then uh, I'll just reduce it from here. Remove this and then edit the payment link as well. Okay, I'll remove the rest from here. So I'll just reduce this because this is good for SEO and then I'll check. So uh, the category where I want to import it to is the prop uh, category. And then come down here to the description if there is anything i don't want here i'll just need to click and then delete so i'll scroll down scroll down scroll down here if there is any image that you are not satisfied with you want to remove it you go ahead and then you click and delete all right um so for some of these images that comes with logo hmm, this image is now there's a logo attached to it so all i just need to do is to click on edit now once it brings you here you can click on your brush um, you use the uh, the eyedropper here to pick up a color here and then use your brush to okay get the color here and then use your brush to to clean up things a bit so you can go ahead and then click on this and once you are done um you just click on save and that will be saved so once that is saved um if there's any image you don't want you can remove you can see all of the attributes that are on aliexpress is importing everything into your website so you go ahead look at all of these things are imported automatically into your website you can go ahead and clean up things a little you know add up things if you want to and at the end of the day um, instead of publishing, I will add it up to import list because I want to edit it before I publish it. So I just add it up to import list. And once I add it up to import list, I'll now go back to my website and check, look at my import list and see how I can clean up this thing a little and then before I, I now publish it. So if I go back here and then go to my import list, will definitely see the product i just imported now okay which is this this is the product i just imported now so all i need to do now before i publish this i'll go ahead and click on edit because i want to import some of the reviews we have here i'll come back here and then i can edit this and then add a short description at the product here so scroll down here Add a short description here and then um, I'll go to the review tab here where it says reviews and then I can check up this I want to import anything from four star higher and then up to 20 reviews and uh, 
I will import them to my draft because I will need to edit some of those reviews are not in English and then some of them comes without names like this now there is no name so I will have to edit all of this that do not have names and see how to clean up things a bit and then import reviews that has images and go ahead and import and once that is done I'll go ahead and publish my post so basically that is our drop shipping um, uh, you can import product into your drop shipping website using the Ali dropship website now in a case where you have um, an order how do you fulfill that order you don't need to stress yourself you are going to get an email for and for orders so once I go to the order here um, I'll just click on the order and then uh, for this is completed and this is processing I have fulfilled this order already so it's been shipped to the customer so all I just need to do is click on the order and once you click on the order here um, you have this icon here that says place order automatically so once I click on this icon which I'm going to show you this order is placed automatically and at the end of the day the customer the supplier of this product ship this uh, product purchased by this customer directly to the customer without me doing any work all I just need to do is to focus on promotion and um, that is it so I'll go ahead and place the order so I'll show you how this uh, simply works so let's take a look at it and before I go ahead and place this order for payment I actually use um, paper and then there is a video in the uh, description of this there's a link in the description of this video where I show you how to create a PayPal account in Nigeria so I that I can actually receive money with PayPal you can receive and send money using the video tutorials I've created you don't need to go and pay 7500 naira for uh, any product for to learn how to create a, a PayPal account so um, for PayPal the same thing that is applied the way you create PayPal here is the same way you create PayPal in any other country that is not supported so go ahead and use the description below and then if the person clicks on proceed to check out you have the option of paying um, with making payment with paypal or flutter wave so with this flutter wave equally allows somebody you to receive payment worldwide and then paypal as well so basically i prefer paypal so one payment is made which is um, easier for people to use one payment is made i receive the payment in my paypal account and then i fulfill the order um to the so the, to the customer through the supplier so basically that is how drop shipping works so the next thing now is to fulfill this order so i just click on place order automatically and let's see how it works so once we click on it um this dialog box comes up and you can see as you can see on the screen here um aliexpress is checking up and loading up these things so let's just give it time to load up So it takes a little bit of time to uh, load up this to clarify this and at the end of the day you see that it's adding the product here we can see that it's adding up the product um, we we'll just give it time the product has been added and it's still processing so all right so automatically it redirects us to uh, Aliexpress website and you don't need to do anything all you just need to do is just sit down and watch why this is done automatically so it keeps placing the order it fills in the customer's information the customer's address the person's email every information the customer has provided in your own shell in your store will be automatically filled in there so um, you just sit down and watch why the magic of uh, dropshipping takes place with Ali dropship So as you can see every information the shipping information all of this information has been filled in automatically so all we just need to do now is just to make payment and that's all so once we make payment this product will be shipped to the customer so let's see how we can go ahead and make that payment right away so all i need to do now is fill in my 
uh, credit card information some of these payment plans some of these suppliers accept paper some don't accept so in this case there is no paper paper is not active so i will need to use my credit card so i just go ahead and fill in my credit card and then click on confirm um so i'll just do that off the screen and put in my credit card details and then once i click on confirm i'll make the payment and then three dollar 84 cents should be less than a thousand naira or one thousand it should be approximately around one thousand uh, five hundred naira for this product which i have sold already for nine dollar um 90 cents or thereabout yes it was nine dollar 90 cent that the customer paid so i'm going to pay three dollar 84 cent for this so all i just need to do fill in my credit card details and then off we go so once i click on confirm um you can see that everything is there i just click on place order and the order will be placed and basically that is how you do it even if you have had um, 100 orders this is the procedure you use to fulfill the order and all you just need to do is just to keep track of the order once it's delivered to the company to the buyer from you you go back to your dashboard and then set it up as a complete order so this is where you can have track of your order you can go ahead these are the orders are fulfilled um, already using my dropshipping website so you can see the different orders that people have purchased from me at the market so you just need to go ahead the first one here is um, the one I just fulfilled now using this video tutorial so basically that is how you fulfill your order and you can keep track of it once it delivers to why the company the, the buyer tracks it um, from his own end his or her own end you equally keep track of it and you know when the order has been delivered so once this order is delivered to the uh, the buyer you go ahead and then ask the buyer to actually uh, leave a review on, on on the website so basically that is how dropshipping works and uh, it is something you can start from the comfort of your home and i'm betting you to go ahead and give it a try so go ahead, give dropshipping a try and see what you can come up with. If there is anything I've missed out, use the comment section below to add it up if you are into this business. And if you want to go into the business, um, you are highly welcome. And I hope this video was helpful. Give it a thumbs up. Subscribe to my channel to get more videos like this. Thank you.